Good evening, teacher. Good evening, teacher. Hello, guys. Welcome. Hello. It's vacation. Yeah, yeah it's coming up. Yeah. Coming up okay. Yeah, the love night. All right, Babner. Keep on rolling, baby. Now what time it is? Actually, ah. uh, Limbiscuit. Limbiscuit. Oh. <laughs> yeah, of course. A great, right. great, great music. Yeah, of course. So welcome, guys, to all of you. It's actually keep a great chance to rolling, have you rolling. here in a class ready to practice English because that's one of the goals, you know? That is good when you are studying English and you understand music you like in English. It's a very nice satisfaction. Now, there are some songs or that you say, you know, I like this music, but because we don't know English, we don't understand, right? But in our case, uh, and we we also like, you know, you know, music or movies in, in English, series in English. So it's good when you understand what they are talking about. It's a very nice uh, satisfaction, right? So welcome and ready to, you know, study and practice. We have some activities very interesting to develop here in the class and also that you can produce your language. Yes? So let's do it. Let's see. And uh, Jay, well, we were talking about different situations and also experiences, you know, how are customs in Part A different in your country? So um, if people invite you to their homes, what do you think? What happened? Try to match because um, what happened? In El Salvador, if people invite you to their homes, what happened? What is the customs? Si alguien los invita a su casa, ¿qué es una de las costumbres de lo más común? What's one of the most common things that perhaps we people do at, at when they invite you to their homes? To bring coffee. Yeah. To celebrate. To bring coffee. The, the eat uh, bread. Bread. Uh, semita. <laughs> yeah. Yes. And, I mean, <laughs> and also coffee or... Coffee it's the most common. Coffee the most common. And right. Coffee in the, and sweet bread. Coffee the and, and the sweet bread. Or uh, the 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 soap, the chicken. Mm -hmm. Okay. Right. The soap, the the bean, the rice, the cream, uh, aguacate. <laughs> So it is a tradition to very get good, food. Very good, very good soap. The brick that being. So it is a tradition to give food. Yes. Okay. Then sounds interesting. So if they invite you to your to their homes, they attend you. They give you some food. Um, you know, also you like sweet bread, coffee. It's a very nice tradition. Number two, when you go out with your friends, with friends for dinner. What is the customs? What happened when you go out with friends for dinner? What is the most the, common the, or the, a custom? Typical typic food is a uh, bean, uh, platano. No, no. How do you say platano? Platane. Platane <laughs> is a uh, is a uh, typic. I mean, to buy some food or to eat uh, typical food? Typical food. Mm -hmm. Okay. What Any other tradition do you remember? Share the account, maybe. Uh, I'm sorry, can you repeat it? The tradition when, 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 the, when we go out with my friend, char the account. Short the account. Sure. Explain us about it. Compartir la cuenta, teacher. Ah, share. Share the account. Okay. Share. Okay. Mm -hmm. All sure. of you, all of you pay, right? All of you get some money to pay, right? Okay, that makes sense. So they share the you know the tickets, everything, right? Yeah. That is a common. Okay, you five dollars each, ten dollars each. So all of you give some money for that. That's right. And number three, if a friend gets engaged to be married, what is the tradition if a friend gets engaged to be married? Mm 
Yes. What is the tradition? Right. Tell me about it. How, how do you say hacerle una despedida? <laughs> okay. All right. A farewell party. <laughs> the gift. Being a geek. Uh, a party. party. A party. A party. Despedida uh, es una fiesta de solteros. Teacher. Party. Single party. Single party. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Single party. Yeah, so that that's okay. That could be a very interesting, you know. And also people say a stock a stack party. Also, some other people know it as a stock party. That's okay. So, you know, gets engaged to be married. Okay, that makes sense to me. And it's very common. People celebrate, they organize, and they, they have fun and enjoy it a lot. So they talk about it. Okay, any other comments about the number three? Okay, number four, when a relative has a birthday. When a relative has a birthday, what happened? Mm -hmm. What is the most common? Oh, it pizza. Go out and eat pizza. Okay. That's good. Yeah. I, I used to do it when, when I was a kid with some relatives. We used to go to a restaurant pizza. and eat pizza. What else? Is it the cakes? Ah, okay. Uh, get a cake. Yes. The party. The, the, the dinner. And a special dinner? Dinner, a special dinner or or lunch. Okay. And there is something important. There is something that you always have to take. What is that? The gift, the presents, because you have a present for them. And also we were yes. talking about... Yes, yes, a gift, a present. Yeah, okay, I have a present. So you, if you go to a party and you don't have a present, it's like, hey, what happened? So you have to bring a present or a, a gift card, for example, or uh, as we say in Spanish, como un sobre, right? Regalo de sobre. So, you know, people do that too, but always it's, it's important to have a present. What else? What else we can add about when a relative has a birthday? Cuando un familiar tiene un cumpleaños, pues tiene una celebración de cumpleaños. Uh, we have a party in your house with in their, in with, their home? Pi, with in your home, see si? your home okay. with piñatas depending oh, piñatas, on the yeah. age, <laughs> depending on the age. Yeah, depending the age, right? And also the tradition 15 years, right? The 15 years party. Then in a Salvador is like very common, right? This when is, they celebrate the big party. Yeah, y con sus chambelanes, y, you know, and they make a big party, they dance, you know, they, it's a great celebration for people. In El Salvador, it's, uh, it's común. Yeah, it's very common, definitely. That is very, very traditional. Cool. It's very traditional. That's it's right. In the, United, in the United States, it's 16. It's different, but they, I mean, they have different it's celebrations. They have different celebrations. And, and also uh, people from El Salvador who travel to US, they try to have a celebration similar to the ones we have in El Salvador. Because they are Salvadorans, of course. They have this the same thought. Let's make a party. So that's different. Okay. And um, number five, if, if a friend is in the hospital, if a friend is in the hospital, what happened? The visit. The visit. The visit uh, the, in the hospital. Mm -hmm. Okay, you visit this person to the hospital. The visit, I'm all right. You visit the person. 
uh do you do you get something for the person or just just go and stay with this person what's the person depending on the person some people for example they traditionally when somebody is in the hospital especially women they bring uh roses they a bouquet of roses they give uh roses to the person or flowers mm -hmm. Yeah, it's very traditional, but not yeah. here. I don't know in El Salvador, but in the U.S. is very common. Someone, a, a lady or a, a woman is in the hospital, you get some flowers for this person. Mm -hmm. And um. Yeah, aquí lo único que le llevan a uno cuando están en el hospital son jugos. <laughs> <laughs> Un poco, yes. un par de jugos. <laughs> English, y, English. Las galletas. <laughs> yes. Es <a> común. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> But the penny because in the price, house, the price, the, the, the food. Depending. Because there are some hospitals that they don't allow bring some food to patients. It's, it's, it's important. It's it's not acceptable for in some hospitals that people bring some food for patients mm -hmm. or sick people. So depending. Depende la dieta que tenga el paciente. Exactly. If they got a surgery, you, they cannot eat. And also, they won't allow you to bring some food. No lo va a, no lo va a ver una pupusa ahí y el, y el paciente ahí no lo van a dejar entrar, ¿no? <laughs> Electrolyte teacher. Yeah, so... Mm -hmm. Depending what hospital is that, of course. <laughs> yes. Todo depende de si, si le dejan el lugar al hospital los alimentos. Que hay, hay reglas. Are yeah, you... there are some rules. There are restrictions. And what about public hospitals? Do do people? I don't know if people allow to to bring some food for patients. I don't know. But maybe I think not. Right. Um. Number six. When someone is going to have a baby, what is the most common? The party, the baby shower. Mm -hmm. Is uh is the most common. It's a common. Is that a party or a, a celebration? Is that a party? Celebration, celebration. Celebration. Yeah. Baby celebration. Yeah. Or a ceremony. <laughs> also could be a ceremony or something like that. Yes, because it's a ceremony. Yeah, it's not a party because there is music, people don't dance. So I think it's... Yeah. Yeah. What else? What else? The, the pregnant woman, like, uh, she can't dancing. <laughs> But as a game, or uh, as a game, she dances yes. in a game. A lot of games, but but the, eh, ¿cómo serían the in, los invitados? ¿Cómo serían? The guest. Uh huh. The guest, not for the, the woman. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. So they play some games. They they play some games, some activities they develop in the baby shower. So they have fun and also they the eat. Yeah, ladies, uh, right? And, I mean, do 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 men go to baby showers or, or only women? Only women. Only women. No, in this time, are uh, the men involved in the baby shower too? Are invited to Generalmente. men are invited. Generalmente, solo, solo mujeres. No, Depending. it's mother in the mother time. <laughs> So yes. men are invited to the party, to the baby shower. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. In my son, my case, my son, my... eh, yo estuve, pero porque anduve grabando, no porque no permitían los hombres. Okay. <laughs> well, I'm going to be honest with you. I have never been in a baby shower. <laughs> so I don't know about that. So yeah, but most of the time women are like, are like responsible but there are some baby showers that men are invited to be there, but no many men. It's like some specifically. But yeah. And some people, I don't know, but perhaps happen that sometimes men don't don't feel comfortable in baby shower. What do you think? sea cómodo que pues lo, los hombres estén en el baby shower o se aburrirían what do you think no it's, it's... boring teacher <laughs> no it's funny it's funny um, 
stickers and I like I like she's very very games different different games for example different game for example eh, uno que hacen con papel higiénico que te tienes que te dan un pedazo y tienes que uh -huh. eh, eh, como calcular el tamaño del estómago de, 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 oh, de, de, de la chica yes. depending the host um perhaps and also depending who organizes these things okay 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 so that that could be interesting right so you know you know how it is the type of celebrations are most of the time um are for women but the, but men also go too that's uh, one of the things that maybe we can discuss about well, um, let's continue. So we can actually think about some some customs or traditions that most of the time people do for party, celebration, games. When you go to church, if you go to church, there are some others too. Well, speaking, this is our time to practice. You know, I have listened that you speak English pretty good. So, you know, look, look at this person, Canadian doctor in Nepal. Look this one. A Canadian person, but look how she dressed. She dressed. What it says. Let's read together. What should a visitor to your country know about local customs? Make a list include this point. Dressing appropriately, staying in someone's home, traveling by bus or train, and giving and receiving gift, taking photograph, shopping. So look at this one. So look at this one. What do you think about it? I think one one thing that other other person needs to know before they come here in El Salvador is that we we eat the pupusas with our hands because sometimes the because sometimes people want to to eat this with like with like a spoon or or something like this i think they they would know that we eat it with our hands the pupusas <laughs> <laughs> yeah yeah when you see someone um you know eating you know yeah so in that case it's it's like because most of the time people eat it with their hands, right? It's commonly. So you see someone else doing eating with a fork, for example, because they 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 get some fork, forks, uh, fork, and so it's like it's not from a sabla, right? Fork, penelor. Okay. So what should a visitor in your country know about? Okay, resting inappropriately, staying in someone's home, traveling by bus or train, giving or receiving gift, taking photographs, shopping. What else you can include in the list? For example, I don't know if you know about uh tradition um in El Salvador and people uh, eat uh, the chuco, atol chuco. Have you heard about atol chuco? What is the combination for atol chuco? What else uh, you need to have when you eat an atol Red. chuco? Black Red. corn? Black corn. Black corn. Squash. Uh-huh. Uh okay. Maíz negrito le llamo, pues. Mm -hmm. And beans, 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 and bread. Yeah. Yeah. I washed it. Yes, and also the bread. Uh -huh. the bread and the chili. Hot pepper. Hot pepper. Hey, yeah, and also the bread. Mm -hmm. and, and the famous. Hot uh, pepper. When you got the bowl. 
Very good. Very famoso. Very good. Da, da morro. Bolillo. Yes, yes, that's right. Ah, the morro, the morro guacal. <laughs> okay, so a customs could be that you had to eat it with bread. ¿Qué combinación mm -hmm. tiene un atolchuco y pan francés? Nobody knows, only Salvadorans know that. Very good. Yeah, of course. It's I like to come up in my case. I think yeah, new generations, you... adolescents or teenagers don't know about atolchuco. I'm pretty sure. They don't no, know about atolchuco. You ask a, a, an, an adolescent about that and they say, okay. I don't know. What sure. is it? It's like really no. I don't like being. Uh -huh. They don't <laughs> like batolchuco. Yes. Yeah, so... Never. Never <laughs> drink batolchuco, the teenagers. Some people say that they don't drink water after eating an atolchuco. I don't know about that, man. You, you, sure. you <laughs> the... Yeah. Uh -huh. Go to the bathroom after you uh, drink water. Drink water. Go to the bathroom for some hours. Yeah. How do you say corre que te alcanzo, teacher? <laughs> <laughs> so that's very really complicated. So you know, people, but people love that. I mean, I, I mean, well, I like it. That I'm, you... I'm going to be honest with you. I, I can see that few people nowadays cook and sell a tolchuco. Time ago, a lot of people used to sell them, but for example, in my neighborhood, few people um, cook and also sell this special recipe. Okay, think about it. Okay, what else you can include in the list? Is quays in honey? Honey? Yes, is quays in honey. 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 Mm -hmm. In honey? Ah, I ah, yes. <laughs> yeah. uh -huh. Pumpkin. Pumpkin. Uh-huh. With Chilacayuca. Honey. Mm -hmm. Chilate con nuegado. Yeah. In Naulingo is the famous chilate con nuegado. No like it, chilate. Con tomate. No another like tradition, it. another customs or tradition in El Salvador. Pupusas. Right, very good. For example, uh, jocote with honey in Easter week. Ah, but this Correa. is in Holy Week? In, in Holy Week? In Holy Week, uh-huh. You can the eat torrejas. The torrejas, yeah. I love them. Those are my favorite. Riguas. Cat. Yeah. Thank so much. Ah, riguas with corn. Oh, by corn. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Also food, we can talk about a lot of food. And uh, yeah, you know, this is very interesting. But there are some other traditions that are not related to food. Think about other traditions that maybe are not related to food. Mm, what could be? Think about it. For example, well, some Valentine's that is something that people do. You have to, people celebrate it. It's like a very common. Uh, the famous uh, secret friend and other customs that you know some people they celebrate they uh, also they i don't know how to explain that if they play the secret friend yeah that you make a raffle and also with the names of people who played it and if you get the name of a person you have to give him or give her a present 
a gift with a specific price. Okay, $20, $50, depending. Another custom we had here in El Salvador was in, in some years ago to to spend fireworks at at Christmas, but nowadays it is not so common. And I think it it was different than than people in the United States celebrate a Christmas, because I think only here in El Salvador we we born fireworks at 12, 12 or 12 mm -hmm. p.m. in the night, in the midnight at Christmas. Okay, yeah. Sure. It, it's because Americans celebrate more the Thanksgiving Day. For them, Thanksgiving Day is a very big party. And also Jesus Christ, but but they celebrate more traditionally uh, Thanksgiving Day. Tell me. No, eso le iba a decir que en esa cosa no celebramos el Día de Acción de Gracias. Ajá. Uh -huh. <laughs> <Yeah>. No, only <laughs> in the United States. There are there are some celebrations that that maybe, I Day mean, come from, from other countries. Like for example, San Valentine's Day is not a Salvadorian celebration, but for economically, traditionally, from other things, they took you know this celebration, but it's not a Salvadorian celebration. I know. So Mother but if the Independence Day like this. Mm -hmm. Okay. We the the most famous celebration or custom in El Salvador is the Mother's Day. Mm -hmm. And the 15th day's party? What do you think? Mm -hmm. Ah, yes. In the in other countries, I know celebrate the 16th and El Salvador is 15th. Yeah, the sweet 16th, the sweet, sweet 16th, yeah, something like that. And also the famous uh, 15 years for specifically for ladies, and they have the dancers, like we call in Spanish, like the chambelanes, the chambelan. And what are the names of the people who danced? Um, chambelanes, right? No. For me, I don't know. I mean, the chambelanes are the guys who dance in the 15 years party. Las damas de honor, right? I'm not yes, I'm sure about yes. it. Yeah, the da damas yes. de honor, and the other one is the chambelanes, right? No, the chambelanes, the, the, the guy who dances with the lady <laughs> who's, you know, celebrating, right? The spring ladies. <laughs> okay. Las primaveras. Yeah. So, yeah, something like that. Maybe it was a tradition, but after the pandemic, everything changes. Everything is like getting back to normal. Yeah. Look at this one, useful okay. expression. Okay. And one of the most important things to, re to remember is, another thing to keep in mind is, one thing visitors often don't realize is, so there are some common expressions that perhaps we can talk about. Okay, let's continue with the next activity because we have discussed about some famous celebration, taking photographs, the selfies, you take some selfies, it's very traditional. And the most typical when a visitor comes to El Salvador is going to the beaches, going to the, the, the Las Tunas, going to the Costa del Sol beach, going to, what's the Sur name, City. the Tunco? Sur City. Yeah, I, I was I was watching in the news that there is a, fam a famous actor, an American actor that is, is uh, surfing in the Tunco, um, it's a uh, very famous for some movies. I don't know the name of this this actor, but he's actor and producer, and he's he has been for three days in the Salvador surfing. He's a a, a a a North American actor and producer. So they love the beaches in El Salvador. Okay, look at this next activity. Yuvud Valley, Indonesia. Writing a tourist P. 
pamphlet. Choose five points from the list you made in exercise 10. Use them to write a tourist pamphlet for your country. And also you can see one example of a pamphlet. Tips for travelers. When you visit Indonesia, there are some important things you should know. For example, if you are visiting a mosque or, or temple, um, it's not acceptable to take photographs. Also, you are supposed to. So that's what you had to do. You had to work uh, and also create a pamphlet, a tourist pamphlet with five points that people should take into account when they go to a place. For example, in Indonesia is this respectful taking so photograph to a temple and it's disrespectful because it's a sacred place for them so it's not acceptable it's sacred it's sagrado para ellos no pueden tomar fotos so you had to like think about a, a, a very tourist pamphlet in which you give five points about tourists cannot do when they come to El Salvador that's what we had to do so eh, de los puntos que vimos anteriormente, pues ustedes pueden tomar algunos o pueden agregarles nuevos, como este, por ejemplo, dressing appropriately, staying in some, someone's home, traveling by bus or train, eh, or giving or receiving gift, taking photographs, shopping, que, ¿cuáles son aquellas tradiciones que usted puede hacer, puede tener cuando viaja a tal lugar? So it's recommendable to do that, right? So, entonces, puede tomar algunos ejemplos de estos, pero está a hacer un pamphlet, lo va a medio ahí decorar, de manera breve, va a tomar los cinco puntos, y luego los vamos a socializar en grupos. Yes? Is, is that clear what we had to do? Yes, teacher. Excellent. Perfect. So, think about, be creative, and also think about this important, you know, five points from the list you make, and I'll give you some minutes to do that.
Okay, so let's take advantage of our checking the, the attendance list. So just uh, give me a moment to pass the attendance list. Okay, so let's update the attendance list. Uh, Brigitte Lisset Eraso. Brigitte? Present teacher. Thank Present you. Teacher. Uh, Carmen Guadalupe Escamilla. Carmen? Present teacher. Present. Thanks. Uh, Cesar Alexander Ramirez. Present teacher. Thank you. Dina Elizabeth Flores. Present teacher. Thanks. Um, Edith Araceli Guzman. Present teacher. Thank you. Eduardo Alexander Díaz. Present teacher. Thank you. Elvis Aníbal Rauda. Él dijo que no iba a poder estar. Okay. He won't. Thank you. Emerson Alexander Mejía. Present. Eh, Eneida Yamilet González. Present teacher. Eh, Jaime Roberto Aldana. Present. Javier Ernesto Lucero. Present. Karen Suleima Ciseña. Present. Thanks. Laura Michelle Arce. Laura. Eh, María Catalina Corea. María. Marvin Fernando Marcel. Present teacher. Eh, Morena Guadalupe Fuentes. Present teacher. Thanks. Oscar Alberto Rodríguez. Oscar, Raquel Areli Santos, present teacher, thanks, Santiago Antonio Chávez, present teacher, thanks, uh, Sara Nalda Guzmán, Sara, okay, um, the equation is, are you ready? Yes? Yes, teacher. Yes. Okay. Excellent. So let's work at the break at rooms and we will take a short time to practice. You will share your pamphlet and you will talk about five things that we need to know, we need to take into account.
to share and socialize. So let's work right now with this activity and be ready with the screen. Let's go. Good evening, teacher. Okay. In, okay. I, 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 I think about um, the topic in the Salvador, the dressing appropriately is um, shirt, shorts, <laughs> and blue jeans because the weather is hot. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, not is common staying in someone's home because uh, their neighbors are uh, very dangerous, especialmente en el pasado. Creo que ahora yes. ya es un poco más seguro, pero yes. en el pasado eh, era en ciertos lugares. No you se can walk or anyway. Yes, mm -hmm. yes, yes. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, we we are traveling in, in in bus or Uber or taxi. <laughs> yes. Mm -hmm. Continue. A moto, moto taxi too. Mm -hmm. <laughs> other, other person continue. <laughs> okay. 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 Me. Mm -hmm. uh, That's right, Marvin. Okay. Uh, uh, I would like to visit friends. If if I visit a friend, I would love to travel, but the bus or train to see mm -hmm. a different place para poder ver diferentes lugares. Mm -hmm. I would also like to visit the park and museums, as well as talk to the different people with order to learn about reality for their culture. Yeah. Uh, mm -hmm. uh, I will the end the my visit uh, with saying uh we get sunset mm -hmm. que sería un atardecer with my mm -hmm. girlfriend. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's fine. It's romantic. <laughs> it's me, Marvin. <laughs> pues, pues sí, ese sería nuestro final ya después de visitar. In the end. <laughs> In the end. Okay. Well, <laughs> tips for a traveler. When you visit El Salvador, there are some important things you shall know. The first one, no smoking will. 
no smoking weed because there are people and other country is legal, but here not. The number two, do not throw the garbage in the street. For, for example, and the number three, don't burn garbage too. Mm -hmm. And the number four, don't eat pupusa with the fork. No, mm -hmm. in El Salvador. Mm -hmm. And that's it in my case. Mm -hmm. my, my tip for traveler. Mm-hmm. Okay. Well, okay. Uh, and me, uh, mm -hmm. this for travel. Uh, we had enough money. Uh, dressing appropriately. Taking a uh, photography. Shopping. We go with people who also like the play. Uh, hydrate. If you drive uh, in your car, check in before uh, leaving. Bring something to eat. Something to eat. Mm -hmm. Well, okay. And now, eat. Edith. Are you there? <laughs> yeah. Yes. Um, when traveling to the United States, I realized that it's important to take off your shoes when entering um, some, someone else's house. Is that? That's it. Okay. <laughs> Who else? In, in El Salvador, there are many interesting places uh, to take photos. Uh, for example, waterfall, a beach, mountains. Etc. <laughs> Towns, a taco, for example. Uh huh, uh huh. Yes. Yeah. I love it, a taco. It's, yes. Me too. Mm -hmm. Beach. <laughs> the weather is, is cold. Mm -hmm. Ever, uh, uh, you, you, you had a recommend a uh, restaurant? Yes. Are you in a taco? Or oh, where? Uh, in a, in a taco? Yeah, the other, cualquier, cualquier lugar. Ah, uh, yes. Uh, uh, I love some. Uh, Mauritas. I love it so much. I like it so much. And I, I like to um, Puerto Marisco. Because mm. I love it, the seafood. Yes. Delicious food in, in Puerto Marisco. <laughs> yes. Mm -hmm. Is is the mayor beach? Mm, no. I only it's know a... the Metalio. Metalio. Metalio have um in the sea. There are uh, like uh, say in Spanish, uh, como le llaman este alfaque. In cambio, in the Los Cobanos beach is the best, one of the best uh, uh, beach in the country because don't have alfaque. De eso, de eso que como remolinos que se hacen en arena y de sal y dicen que oh, jalan yes. la gente. Eso es en metal. Yes, yes. It's dangerous. Yes, it's dangerous because say the people in, in near the, the sun, in the ocean, Dicen que si hay un alfaque allí, aún así se lo puede jalar. Eso es en metalío. But in Los Cobanos Beach, no, it's very good. It's one of the best beach in the country because I know that in other beach, and no, it's a similar to Los Cobanos Beach. Mm -hmm. It's very good, the beach. It's for public beach. Mm -hmm. My father was born in Sonsonate. I like to go to the... Mm -hmm. 
George Sonsonate to eat yuca. Yes, to eat ah, yuca. Uh, is in, yuca. Afuera, afuera. ¿En uh, Salco? Out. No. Eh, ah. de, ¿No, en Salco? No, Sonsonate. Sonsonate um, Center. The in, town. In the town, Sonsonate mm -hmm. is uh, for church. I like I like to eat uh, to eat yuca um, with pork. In park, in park, yes. Near the yes. park in downtown for the near the for the cathedral. Yes, I I only remember. Um. Uh, H H. 20 years. Ah, that 20 years ago. Yes, 20 years ago. Uh -huh. Yes. In Sonsonate, um, there are a lot of change in the last years. Uh -huh. En los últimos años ha tenido muchos cambios. Ha cambiado mucho. Yes, time is over. <laughs> okay. Yes, See you pronto, soon. pronto. Yes, goodbye. Thank you. Yes, bye. Okay, students were back. So perhaps the time was not enough, but there are great things that maybe we can discuss about Salvador, like, you know, some customs or traditions. And um, also about food, about how people behave, how people act, also respect the culture, respect the country. And also, you know, do you consider them, that Salvadorans are friendly or not? What do you think? Do you think that Salvadorians are friendly or not? Yes. I yes. think, yes, we are too much friendly compared with other countries. Yeah. Or we are too friendly. Yeah, exactly. For example, there are some places that people don't talk. Like, they are very serious. They And also, a, a tradition or, or a custom in the morning is that Salvadorians say good morning, always. It's, it's a it's a custom, right? Mm -hmm. quien sea. Yeah. Yes. 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 Uh -huh. hey, yes. Good afternoon, good evening. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's it's very common. Mm -hmm. In other cultures, people don't greet. If they don't know mm -hmm. you, they don't talk to you. But in El Salvador, mm -hmm. they always say good good morning or good afternoon. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yes, teacher. And also friendly. Salvadorans are very friendly and also uh, uh, something that, that people say about Salvador is that we are hard workers because we work all the time. We mm -hmm. like the job. We like to work. People, Salvadorian, love to work. This is a mm, very yes. interesting, yeah. Salvadorians, uh, we are very kind too. Yes, and very helpful. Mm -hmm. We help people. Salvadorian yes. help others, support. Yeah. And also are funny. Salvadorans are funny too. Yes, we yeah. are funny. <laughs> they Salvadorans are funny. They like to have fun, to talk. They they like to communicate. You know, we are very special. Okay, students, we're about to uh, finish. Uh, yeah. I am coming because it's the last class. <laughs> yeah, of course, but you had to continue because the next level is even better because you go on to advance. Um, so Keep it up working, guys, and I hope to see you in a different level, of course, and advanced. So keep it up working, keep keep it up learning, and also do your best. So mm -hmm. it was a pleasure, and have a beautiful night to all of you guys. Thank, Thank you so much, teacher. Thank you, teacher. So Thank you, teacher. Yeah, no, Thank you, guys. Thank you for your help. See you the next level. Thanks for the next level. Beautiful night, partners.
Sí, 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 yeah, of course. So, good night to everybody. Bye, 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 bye,